Alright, so this is how we're gonna get a lot of weapon, descendant, and master the rank XP. So, and also you get a lot of uh, void shards that you can use. And uh, you also get weapons that you can dismantle and get weapon parts. Anyways, this can be done AFK or you can also manually do it with friends. It's up to you. Let's get right into it. Alright, so your bunny has to be pretty decked out for this farm. So, first of all, uh, you need a lot of skill cooldown. Mine's at 26.4%. Uh, and you also need a lot of skill uh, effect range which is at 148% for me. I think 140 is like the uh, minimum requirements, I'm not sure though, just test around. For the modules, I run Focus on Electric, Nimble Fingers, and I uh, Time Distribution for the skill cooldown. And for the skill effect range, I use Skill Expansion and Maximum Range. I recommend having these modules to up your range and skill cooldown for this farm. Alright, so we are going to be playing on hard difficulty, so we can get everything out of this farm. Uh, on hard difficulty you get more shards and whatnot. So then go to fortress, go to the fallen arc location and teleport to this checkpoint right here. And then we're going to be farming this void fragment. And from the checkpoint, just follow the path that I take. All you have to do is exit the cave, jump down, and then enter another cave right here. Alright, so for the farm itself, doing this AFK is a bit more complicated than doing this manually. So, to start off, come to this void fragment right here. You see this box, and there's gonna be a little wall right here that you can... Uh, that you can roll towards, and... Just keep on rolling and using your ability over and over and over again. That way you kill all the monsters around you and you also hit the void fragment if you have enough range. So this is basically the farm. And uh, if you want to do this AFK, like I said, it's hard because you have a energy and a MP bar. Your energy bar doesn't come back fast enough for you to just uh, do this over and over again so you're gonna have to use your mp bar and your second ability to recharge it and to get more mp back you will need an item with mp recovery out of combat if you're doing the safe k if you're not doing the safe k you can just run around and pick up mp anyways you can see right here i don't have any energy left so what i do is use my mp to recover energy and this is your best bet if you want to do this afk so there is also another sweet spot on this wall somewhere like it's pretty you have to be lucky to get it you can see it at the start of the video it's where if you roll you get a lot of uh, energy back for some reason i'm not sure why it happens but if you can make it work then you won't have to worry about energy or mp anyways i hope you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching see you guys in the next one